What's up everybody, the con man here. If you watched my last video, I was been busy. But you know, school is basically over for me. Tuesday I have senior barbecue, and that's basically just bring food. And that's all we do Tuesday. Then Thursday is graduation. So Thursday is when I graduate high school, my friends, and I don't have school today or Wednesday. Or Friday, of course, but yeah. But I want to tell you guys something. I got this for my birthday. GoPro Hero 5 Black. And let me tell you something about this. This thing is awesome and amazing. The only one thing is like the audio. It's not the best. But I just ordered a mic for this. So it's going to be fun. We're going to do a couple or most of our vlogs on here as soon as that mic comes in. And we're also getting an extra battery too for that and on top of that I got this pen fishing rod it's basically it looks like a pen and then you take off the cap it turns into a rod and you attach your wheel on it so that's gonna be fun because then we just can put that in my bag and we just go fishing in these little spots we find so yeah and what's happening today Monday the rod might be coming in and we're gonna hang out with Max so let's see what else we can do today some other updates is that I want to show you what random stuff and fishing stuff I got. I don't know if I've shown you guys these, but these are the riper glasses. That was just a random thing I bought. So I bought this umbrella hat. I used to have one and it broke a while back. I was like, I, I need to replace that. Fishing wise though, I got this four pound for the pen fishing rod. So I'm hoping this is not too light. If it is, well, we use like six or eight pound. And another random thing, of course, I had to get a fidget wheel. Everybody has them, you know. Well, I didn't have to, but it, it, it's just fun to go play with and mess around. But yeah. And that's what's basically happening right now. And I don't know if you guys care about art at all. But I made that tiki. Well, you, you guys already knew this, but I made this teapot. The lid comes off. I made this candle thing. It's supposed to be abstract art. It's it's kind of weird. I do. I try not to look at this one. It's kind of creepy. Anyways, guys, I don't know if it's too warm or too. Well, of course it's gonna be warm outside, but it's a little windy. I don't know when Max is gonna get done, so I don't know if we have time to go fishing today. But we probably have time on Wednesday to go fishing. I forgot. You gotta do laundry. Oh, welcome back from the laundry. I just remembered Max is getting off his braces today and his appointment was like at 1130-ish. So he might not get here to like around 1-ish or 2-ish. So we need to figure out something to do, guys. Well, Drew got these. What are these called, Drew? Uh, naked chicken chips. He doesn't like them, so I'm going to let him have one of my soft tacos. But we are going to try one of these. Got cheese on it. Yeah, I don't like them either. Not a fan. Well, I'm basically done putting mine on my bait caster because it got in the post in this last time. And I haven't put mine on it since, so I did that. And I just got done watching the President show. Yeah, been, if you have not seen that show, I would go check it out. It's on Comedy Central. Pretty funny. Uh, right now, I'm just... Basically, just doing random things before Max comes. Well, I don't know how long Max is going to be. I, I haven't heard from him. I called him, like, like it's been like an hour or two. Well, since his appointment's been like four hours, so I don't, four, 
back over, so I don't know if everything's okay or not. So, I called him and texted him, but I haven't heard from him at all. So, we're just gonna go ultra light fishing. Test out my GoPro Hero 5 and see what happens from there. So, hopefully, everything's fine. We have made it to the pond. It is windy outside, so sorry about that. And the water. I don't know if it has turned yet, or if it should that turn means like, like during the winter and spring, the water flips so the bottom comes to the top water-wise. It's, it's that, and it's been raining a lot too, so yeah. I don't know how good we're going to do, we're going to do baits, worms, night crawlers. And the setup we usually do is for the ultralight, it's like a size 3 hook, circle hook. We got little two snap rates on it basically and that's about it and we're gonna put a nightcrawler on there maybe a bobber maybe not and we're gonna see how we do and we're gonna switch oh switch to the gopro now there's a lawnmower behind me so sorry about that guys but let's see what we can catch today We got a fish, a little bluegill. <laughs> nice. Oh. There he is, guys. Little bluegill. Let him go. <laughs> we got one. We got another one. Ooh, this one seems a little bit nicer. Ooh, is this a catfish, maybe? Oh my god, we got a catfish. I think this is a catfish. Yeah, it's a catfish. <laughs> I never caught a catfish on an ultralight. <laughs> How funny. Okay, now we gotta be really careful. Hopefully the line does not break. Come on, stop, chill. Ah, how nice. You hear him croaking? There he is. Nice catfish. It's been bruised up a little. Let's go take a picture of him. Put him back. And there he goes. We still have a worm too. We're getting bites. We got another one. Second bluegill. Nice. Haha. <laughs> Little bluegill. We're doing good today. Alright, let's put him back. Just caught two bluegill and one catfish. Yeah. Uh, about five inches for the bluegill and about uh, almost a foot for the catfish. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Oh, there is a fish on here. That's oh, another catfish. It was running towards me. I was so confused. <laughs> these are so fun, though, catching catfish on these ultralights, guys. Man. You, just these little guys were fun. 
Oh, it's going for a run. A little bit bigger this time. Oh, he is not happy. Yeah, a little bit bigger this time. Oh, whoa, whoa, do not stop the l Hey, I'm not gonna eat you. Oh, there he is. Sorry about that. The hug will come out of him in a couple of days. That'd be good. Got something, people. And we caught a baby bass. Ooh, calm down there, baby bass. Alright, little baby bass. So we caught two bluegill, two catfish, and one largemouth bass. Well, channel, yeah, two channel catfish and one largemouth bass. Cool stuff, guys. This line is messed up and there's a big fish on here guys. Oh god, this is this is not good. Oh no, it's not a big fish, it's just a little bluegill. I just need to fix the line. Alright. I was scared for a minute that the line was gonna break. Ah, oh. oh, spined. <laughs> Dude, these fish are crazy, bro. Oh, look at this bluegill. It's the biggest one of the day. This one's really pretty. The blue under its mouth. It's so shiny and golden. It's such a beautiful fish. Let's put him back. Gentle as a kite. Oh my, this is a fish. Whoa. Whoa, that one just hit it like it was nothing. This is a big catfish. Either a big one or the same size as, whoa. Stay low. Okay, this fish is not playing around. Where, whoa. Whoa, guys. <laughs> Come on, caddy. There you are. Just a little baby with a big head. Should we risk it? Let's risk it. Oh. Perfect, guys. This has been one of the best fishing sessions ever, guys. There he is. Mr. Catfish. Been good, guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. caught him. Oh, all right. Let's just put him back. Gosh, catfish are. I tell you, man, they're really slippery. Ah, oh. time is it? Five o'clock. Second bass. It's... Is 
second bass right there. Pretty nice one. Go back to where you belong. Baby catfish. There he is. <laughs> Look how tiny that is. It's my tiniest catfish ever. Uh, all right. That is our third bass, I believe. He's bleeding, guys. Oh, that sucks. Um, he's probably not gonna do well. Oh, well. These fish. Yeah, he's not gonna be doing well. Oh, I think we're gonna go home now, guys. That was in about an hour, hour and a half session. And we did pretty good. Hopefully that bass is okay. I feel bad. Don't think I don't, I do. I left and I didn't see him. I only saw him pop up once, but he went back down, so. There were two other guys that go to my school. I don't know if they're watching this, but shout out to Christian and Anthony. Uh, they're pretty cool guys. I guess they're starting to get into fishing or whatnot. But I just gave them some of my night crawlers, two weights and two hooks for them, so they could hopefully catch some fish. Cause they saw me catching fish like crazy, so I just gave that to them. And hopefully they do good. Good luck to you guys. And Max texted me, but I don't know what the plan is. So, and that's kind of another reason why I came back home too. So. We'll see what's happening from there. I'm waiting for my editing software to be all done and stuff, but while we wait, I got a letter from Extreme Philly Fishing, Leo Shang, and I'll tell you what it says. Connor Graham, tied lines and fish on sincerely, Extreme Philly Fishing. It's a picture he sent me of him with a small mouth bass on the Senko. And here is his letter. Dear Connor, May 10th, 2016. Thank you very much for contacting Extreme Philly Fishing on social media. I am very glad to hear that everything has been going well for you. As far as we both fish, I am the same that we will meet each other on the water one of these days. P.S. Attached is, attached is your photo. Tight lines and fish on. A.K.A. Extreme Philly Fishing. Sincerely, Leo Shank. So that's cool. I wrote in the letter that hopefully him and I will meet up. And it sounds like he would want to meet up someday. So that's cool, guys. Thank you, Leo, if you're watching this. I appreciate you, man. You're awesome. Well, everything is fine with Max, but he cannot hang out. His braces got all his braces are off, and he is happy about that. This just came in the mail, but we we're gonna do a video, another video, for that. So I'm gonna end today's video. I hope you guys are doing great. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Don't worry, I am back. And tell me what you guys think about the GoPro Hero 5. So I'm going to be... The footage looks good, but the mic might be a little bit off. But it sounds good, but it sounds bad. I don't know, it's a little crazy. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys are doing great. Thank you. And as always, stay classy.